Welcome to NAM 2009. My name is Greg Wallace. I'm with DJNN. We're here to play with the toys, check out all the new equipment, visit with some of the people that put this all together. We've got some big names here like Newmark, American DJ, Pioneer, among many others. So what we're going to do is go inside, play with the gear, talk to some people, find out what's new and what's hot, and find out what the DJs are going to be looking for in the next year to come. So, hey, let's go. <laughs> about and we finally got a chance to come over and talk to the man who's going to tell us about it. Felix is going to be talking about the Newmark HD mix and this is something we actually heard even before we got to the show and the piece is actually here so Felix is going to tell us all about it. Well the HD mix is everything you need as a portable DJ. Why? Because it comes with a removable 80 gig hard drive so that means you can load your hard drive with as many songs as you want. Let's say 80 gig is not enough for you, you can unlock it, take it out, and put as big as a hard drive that you can find in the market, you can utilize it right here. You also have a CD slash DVD audio player, so you can load songs into here, you can play straight from it, or you can transfer from the CD-ROM to the hard drive without the need of using a computer. Now, a hard drive is not enough, you have two USB ports in the back, allow you to plug in an iPod, or a portable hard drive, or a thumb drive if you want to. It also has a backlit LCD screen that allows you to navigate through your files. You can see your song profiles and everything like that. It has the same OS that was made popular by the iDJ2. With that said, you have all your crate features and everything like that, so you can create virtual crates. As a mixer, you have three channels on it. You can play two channels out of the media player, but you also have inputs in the back that allow you to plug in turntables or CDs. Again, as if thousands of songs wasn't enough, you have more expandability on it. All in one case. Again, that is the HD mix. Now, you have thousands of songs, you want to move around, it comes with a keyboard so you can search through your titles and everything like that. We're introducing a case for it now. The case is heavy duty, fireproof case. It comes with a tray and an upgraded backlit keyboard. So if you're in a dark club, you can actually look at your keys, you can see what you're doing. Nice, comes with the keyboard. So this unit is everything. Everything you need. So for the modern DJ, this is definitely what you want to do. Newmark has once again shown what it can. And what's the what's the price on this? You're not going to believe it. Only nine hundred and ninety-nine dollars. So for the professional DJ who wants to make the next step up and they want to use a name that they know, Newmark. Yep, absolutely. Well, thank you very much for your time, Felix. Appreciate it. Okay, coming up right now, I'm with Mike from the Newmark booth here at the NAM show. He's going to talk about a new product called the NS7, and it's also incorporated with a Serato program as well. So tell us about this this piece. Sure. Um, this is the NS7 controller that uh, ships with Serato's itch software. Uh, I've been working on this since it's... Uh, since its birth, I'm a DJ, so made sure that everything in here is gonna cut the mustard for guys that are really demanding scratch DJs or mixed DJs and uh, mobile guys because it's all one single piece. All these units are, are connected. It's uh, got two motorized platters. We've got a mixer section that's gonna be very familiar to any DJ with EQs, gains, master, and boost control. Um, crossfader for the for the headphones and of course a, a high-end crossfader from one of our best battle DJ mixers uh, the, C, the CP Pro fader and we also have traditional controls for a mixer like um, X fader contour and a reverse we have fader start and we have two torque settings for the platters too um, onto the decks we have uh, of course a pitch control we got nudge buttons for pitch bending we've got a reverse option for reversing the motor and we also have a bleep button for bleeping out uh, audio, so you can reverse it but still have the, this track continue forward. Um, very, very cool feature that's unique to the NS7 is the strip search. This is the equivalent to needle dropping around the track. You can actually uh, get anywhere in the track by just tapping or sliding your finger here. Uh, there's a tap tempo, putting in a BPM if your track doesn't have it. There's a start and stop speed adjustments, uh, key lock, pitch range, three options, 8, 16, and 50%. And we've got some cues down here, five of them, and you just turn them red by hitting delete, and now they're ready to be deleted. And you can, the cues are really fun because you can set them up on the fly and start playing drums with them, or hop around a, a track and scratch, and uh, put, a, put together a really cool, exciting performance. Uh, there's a sync button down here, 
for syncing the BPM to the other deck. And um, I mean, you can mix for hours without without using headphones uh, and and just using the the software's transient display. You can sit there and flawlessly mix. Um, on the front, very important. There's a, a quarter inch jack input and RCA input. This is. Uh, can also be sent to the crossfader. So say you hook up a turntable and you want to scratch, you could scratch using this crossfader, play that track, then you could pull the USB cable out, hook up another laptop, and uh, you've solved the problem uh, having multiple DJs on a single unit. The sound card's built into it, and once the software is installed, you plug in the USB, you open, you open up the software, and, and the thing's ready to go. On the back, there's XLR outputs and RCA main outs and RCA booth outs as well. And we are back. With me, I have Tom from American Audio. He's going to tell us about a couple pieces. I was here yesterday, and this is the one piece that really caught my eye right off the bat. It's a single space uh, mixer, which there, there's a few of those out there. But this one actually has some features that I've never seen before on a single space uh, rack mixer. So tell us about this piece. Okay, this is brand new. This is the M52 USB by American Audio. It has talk over mic volume, switchable metering, adjustable crossfade curve, gain control, treble, bass, your input selector on each channel, and you'll notice you have two channels of USB. That makes this the perfect mixer for the computer DJ. This is your sound card. You can go right out of your computer into here, mix your digital files. Same on the second channel, your input selector, gain, EQ. You have a zone out, a master out, total headphone control, and then if you look at the back, you have balanced outputs. You can go right out of here into your professional power amp or your active speakers. You also have an XLR mic in, all your gold-plated input connectors, and your USB connectivity. And this will be out uh, soon, and it will be in the stores for under $200. So this is a serious piece of gear. You can use it either as a backup, maybe if, as a cocktail system, something to do ceremonies. And oh, yeah. You can even use it with a dual CD player, a dual SD player uh, to make an ultra compact system. And again, you can hook your, hook your computer right up to this, and it's the perfect sound card with microphone and headphone control. And at that price, I don't think I've seen a piece of gear that even come close to this. You're right. This is very affordable, and the main thing is it's a very durable great sounding piece of product. It would be perfect for anybody's system. Okay, next up we're going to talk about a piece of gear. It's called the Radius 1000. Once again, it's American Audio. We're with Tom. Uh, so Tom, tell us about this unit and, and uh, what, what's hot on it. Well, there's a lot hot on this and sometimes people forget American Audio is the first company to have touch sensitive scratching on a tabletop CD player. And this is the latest evolution of that. This is the Radius 1000. Basically, it gives you a VFT text display you can see from any angle. It gives you nine different effects that can be synced to the music. Three sample banks. You can actually sample the sequence and have them play. play. You can sequence the sample and have them play back in the order that you like. Full pitch control right there with up to 100% pitch range. Uh, master tempo control as well. Advanced track search, in and out looping. Down here you have your different scratch modes. You'll notice the lights blinking on the large touch sensitive scratch wheel right now. You actually have eight different modes for that, so we're gonna change it up a little bit. Right now they're blinking to the beat of the music. If you want them to follow your cue point around, you can. If you want to invert it, you can. So you can control the, the action of the wheel. You can do the heartbeat as we're gonna call it. So now what's really cool about this is not only is it a full featured CD MP3 player, but it also, when I press this button, now it's a MIDI controller, and I can actually do both. I can be playing CDs, I can reach over and be turning the knobs here, and they're turning on my computer, on my favorite DJ software. I can be scratching my software, controlling the effects, doing everything from here. So you're getting a CD player, MP3 player, MIDI controller, all in one box, in the stores now for about uh, just under $400. We've also added a headphone output on the back with the level control. So this is the next piece of gear that's stepping into the next generation of disc jockeys. It starts off with uh, turntables, CD, MP3, and this thing is just a beast. Yeah, now it's CD and computer control, all from one unit. One thing that I forgot to mention that's really cool, this has eight channels of full MIDI. So I can actually imagine this, you guys. I control eight different decks on my computer from one unit and be switching between all the different decks right here using channels one through eight. So very powerful. So you won't have to have eight units. You can do it all with one unit. It's a beast. Well, thank you very much, Tom. Appreciate it.